you could literally call on her to do anything. She's been uh, really an icon in the community. She's a person that everyone respects, everyone admires, everyone likes to work with and for. I think she is a role model for the people of Westfield. I think she, if we all gave one-tenth of the time that she's given, our community would have many of its needs met. Mary's been involved with Noble for many years. She was at Noble when I arrived. Um, I arrived 30 years ago, and she was one of the first uh, persons to uh, welcome me. She treated me like a son, and uh, which was very nice. I first came to know Mary by her name because a good friend of mine was on the board and talked about Mary O'Neill and how thoughtful she was and what a great leader she was and how she studied the issues to make good decisions. And then several years later I had the good fortune of meeting her and now I can say she's my friend. I first got involved with Mary uh, with, through Noble Hospital through the sponsorship committee. It was the easiest uh, nonprofit call that I ever had to make, the easiest solicitation I ever had to make because as soon as I said I was working with Mary O'Neill it was, how can we help you? We love Mary, we want to help. So many things became family efforts. And, and that really was a, a recurring theme throughout our lives. One of the major fundraisers uh, for then Noble Hospital quite a while back was a, uh, a, an, antique, uh, an antique show. And there was a lot of work involved in setting that up. Um, tables and chairs and things. And I remember once uh, on a Saturday morning during the winter when we were all set to go skiing and um, on the way we noticed that we weren't driving the normal way uh, to head off skiing and lo and behold we ended up at the then the armory in Westfield where the antique show was uh, to take place later that day so that we uh, could help set up tables and chairs and, and get things arranged uh, while our skis sat in the car <laughs> waiting for us and we eventually got got uh, to the, the ski area and had a good day, but uh, it was uh, uh, a, a, a group effort. I enjoyed working with her a lot because when she would come to a meeting, whether it was personnel or facility or whatever it was, whatever challenge, it was always a, a positive, we can do this type attitude, which was really good. Mary has a lot of class. Mary has and I, I like to say class with grace. And I think that's what's special about her. She's a wonderful person, uh, entirely apart from all the uh, great things she's done for uh, Bay State Noble. Uh, her community involvement, uh, her help to all the other people in the community when they need it, her advice, her assistance, uh, it just makes her a real star. Congratulations, Mom, on receiving the Bay State Noble Spirit Award. Uh, you, I'm biased, of course, but you're so deserving of the award. We're all proud of you, and we're thrilled to be here tonight celebrating this award with you.